Hi everyone, today I will be making steamed fish the Vietnamese way. Many of you have requested for this recipe and I also wanted to make a video for it for a long time. But as I didn't have access to fresh fish in Germany, I have been delaying it until now. By fresh fish, I mean fish that are still alive when sold. That's how we define fresh in Vietnam. Our cuisine is valued by the freshness of the ingredients, so most housewives go to markets uh, twice a day to shop. When buying fish here, you can ask the seller to do and clean the fish for you to save the preparation task. I also need to buy some fresh herbs and rice paper for the wrapping. So let's begin! Helen's recipes. Today I bought a small camo or a grouper fish. Some other types of fish that are good for steaming are codfish, white palm fret, snapper, sea bass or tilapia. Clear transparent eyes are a good indication of a fresh fish. I make some incisions um, on both sides of the fish so the seasonings can absorb deeper. Then season each side of the fish with a teaspoon of fish sauce and some black pepper. Then cover and let it sit in the fridge while preparing the other ingredients. For the toppings, you will need some wood ear mushrooms and dry sitake mushrooms. Soak the mushrooms in hot water for about 15 minutes and they will grow bigger like this. You also need some glass noodle soaked in cold water for about 10 minutes to soften. Then rinse the mushrooms well, remove the roots and roll them up, slice into very thin strips. Also cut the shiitake mushrooms into strips. I also want to add some minced pork, but you don't have to. Season the minced pork, mushrooms and the glass noodles with some fish sauce, sugar and pepper. Mix well and set aside. These items gonna add a very interesting texture to the steamed fish. For the glass noodles, you want to cut it short so it's easier to handle later. Also season with fish sauce, pepper and sugar. Then take the fish out of the fridge and stuff some mushrooms, minced meat and ginger into its cavity. Spread the rest of the minced pork over the surface of the fish and drizzle some sesame oil on top. Place the fish on a ceramic plate and steam for about 10 to 15 minutes depending on the size of the fish. Don't forget to add some ginger strips on top as well. After steaming for 12 minutes, I add the mushrooms and the glass noodle on top. Then steam for another 3 minutes and then it's done. When we were kids, my sister and I used to fight who gets to eat the eyes of the fish first. <laughs> I also add some spring onion on top and serve with a plate of fresh lettuce and herbs and a bowl of dipping fish sauce. You can eat the steamed fish with rice, but what we normally do is to wrap it in a piece of rice paper together with the fresh herbs. This is a very special kind of rice paper that I didn't seem to find overseas. It's thin, soft and flexible enough that we don't need to soak in water. The fish is so fresh and juicy, the flesh is white and firm, the toppings are well seasoned. The roll is so fresh and healthy, it's full of textures and flavors. Just dip it in the dipping fish sauce and enjoy! Mmm, it's so good! Just like the delectable dishes that you make and post photos on Instagram, Facebook and Google Plus with hashtag Helen Recipes. I'm glad that you are very open to try out new things like I receive a lot of photos for the rare beef in lamchu salad or bò tái chanh 
I also received many positive feedbacks for the Vietnamese style pasta Nui Sa Bo. That's so awesome. If you like the video, don't forget to click like and subscribe to my channel for more delicious Vietnamese dishes. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.